Hey everybody, and welcome to today's video. And today we're gonna to be unboxing the new shipment that came out from Circle B Diecast. Um, the one that came out like a week ago, but I barely got this because um, of course of shipping delays because of COVID and whatnot. So I barely got this like last uh, yesterday. So I'm unboxing it today. So without further ado, let's um, unbox this new shipment of Diecast. So let me open it and we'll see what it's inside. So we got the package open. So let's take a look at what we have. Well, I know what it is, but let's see what you guys think it is. What like I got from the new shipment. So let me pull this out. They're packed in there really tightly, okay. So let me show you guys what I got. So let's put that aside. So sorry for the mess back there, but here are the new um, die cuts that I got. So let's start with this one. So up here we have Ryan Blaney's 2020 Darlington Throwback um, diecast. Pretty cool, pretty neat. I've been waiting for this one. I had, had to have it for my Blaney collection too. Um, it has the playoff marking, so you right there, playoff and then the silver spoiler. I didn't really like the playoff markings for this year, just the silver that looked like part of the paint scheme for almost every um, car that ran so I wasn't really a big fan of it I'm curious to see what they're gonna do this year because the uh, names if you didn't know already the names are gonna be in the front and the back too so I don't know if they're gonna like make the where the names are like silver and the spoiler silver too or like the number silver who knows what they're gonna do but I'm intrigued to see what they're gonna do this year so pretty cool car I put that right here aside and move that a little bit over there up next we have Ty Dillon's uh, 2020 hump day Number 13, Geico Diecast. Pretty cool car. I just got this because I know I I'm I like the hump day. Uh, I'm intrigued by it. Pretty cool car. This ran on the if you couldn't tell by the tires, <clears throat> it says um uh to protect and serve. I don't know, it says something like that, but it says something to honor the the soldiers because this was ran in the uh Coca Cola six hundred. Pretty cool car. Put that right there. And the last one, Maddie D's 2020 Darlington Throwback 2. With the playoff markings also. Silver spoiler. Pretty cool car. Uh, I'm trying to collect his diecast too because I'm kind of a fan of him. I hope he gets a win this year because he was close. He had like at least three opportunities this, this season. I can hear about the top of my head. He had Talladega, Las Vegas. Um, the first Las Vegas too, he was in the front row with Joey Logano or right behind him and he finished second. So hopefully he could uh, re replicate that this year and pick up some wins. Or at least go a little bit further in the playoffs. So those are the, these are the three new um, diecasts I got from the Circle B new shipment. Pretty cool. Going to be really cool in my collection. And we're not done yet. We have some a little bit, it's not exactly a haul, but we have a little bit more diecast that, that came. So let me pick this up and show you guys what else I got. So here we have these uh, three boxes right here. I have two more boxes, but they're also little, so I'm gonna open it after these. So let's put these aside and open up this one right here. So we got the box, uh, we got it open. And we have another one before. And this is Kyle Busch's uh, 2014 Interstate Batteries. For that, he ran in the the Coca Cola 600 because of the patriotic banner right there at Charlotte. Pretty cool car. I just picked it up because these Toyotas, these um, 2013 to 2014 Toyotas, are really hard to find, and I got this for a really reasonable price, so decided to pick it up. Also, as a Kyle Busch fan too, so. Uh, this will be good in my collection too. So it's pretty cool to put that aside and open up the next one we have. This one right here. So we got this one. Open up. Got a little bit of a little note right there. Thank you, note. Appreciate that. And it's done all this out here. Oh, that's a lot. And we have Danica Patrick's 2018 uh, Final Ride. Uh, Go Daddy. Um, Camaro, pretty cool. Uh, I've been looking for this one, and there they there was some on online, but they're a little bit out of like in the pricey side. So um, this one 
uh, was a little bit cheaper than, than what it usually goes for. So um, decided to pick it up. Pretty cool. So up next we have this uh, package right here. So let me get this opened up and let's see what it is. So we got this package. Uh, we got it open. More packing peanuts. Because I have uh, obviously need more. So let's dump all of that. And we have Carl Edwards 20. 16, yeah, 2016 Stanley Camry. Pretty cool car. Back in the day, I was, before he retired, I was uh, a fan of him. Obviously, he doesn't race anymore. No one, he's uh, <laughs> gone off the grid, so nobody really knows what he's doing right now or where he really lives. But I was a, a, a fan of him back then, so. But still a pretty cool car. Got the Kenner, saw this on um, eBay. I didn't see any other ones, so I decided to pick it up at a really good price, too will be good in my collection so that's cool so we have these three that we got from the packages right here and i have two more like i said before so let me clean this up and get those two and see what's in them so we got these two packages up and both of these are from what i can remember um these two are nascar authentic so uh, let's open up open them up and see what's inside them so we got it opened up and we have all these packages in here and let me take this out and show you guys right now. So it's a Chase Elliott again. And it says 2016 um, 3M uh, Chevrolet SS. Is it his? Yes. I saw the rookie. I was looking at the rookie stripes to see if, if it was his 2016. It doesn't say it right here. But it's 2016 3M um, uh, number 24. I think this was like the only race that 3M sponsored him in. Our like the season because I don't remember him. I don't remember 3M um, sponsoring him for like 2017 and beyond. I think this is like the only season that they sponsored him. Pretty cool car. Put that aside and clear all this and show you guys the next package that we got. So let me get this open and show you guys what we have. So we got this uh, opened up already. Pretty cool packaging. I like it. So it's well packaged soon, so thank you, seller. And let's uh, clear it all out and let me show you guys what we have. So like I said, it's another authentic and it's another Carl Edwards and it's his, his 2016 uh, Darlington Throwback. Eris, uh, throwback to Tony Stewart, um, Tony Stewart's car. I don't know what year it was, but I know it was his, the one that says Home Depot right here with that font. So. If that gives you an idea, I think it was just one of his uh, older cars that he ran. Pretty cool car. I like that. I didn't notice that, that they did that with the other ones. This was Darlington instead of like having all the weights. Pretty cool car. So that's all of them. All the diecasts that I have. So this mini haul. I, I wouldn't really call it a haul. It's more of an unboxing. I just want to show you guys the new um, die cuts that I got for the, from the shipment that came out. Um, probably gonna get more this time for, I have an, another one, another one pre-ordered that's probably coming out next week. So I'm excited for that. But anyway guys, that's today. That's it for today's video. If you guys liked it, um, you know what to do, like the video. If you want to see more of these videos, uh, unboxings, hauls, or die cast reviews, um, please consider subscribing to my channel. Um, it's gonna help a lot to get more views, to get it more discovered. So. Anyway guys, that's it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you guys for watching and see you guys next time.